What is going on everyone? It's your boy Sinister Cobra coming at you with another Halo video. Today we are in the Halo 4 flight. It is finally live. It is Tuesday the... what is it? The 20th. Halo 4 went live. So that's... or Halo 4 flight went live, not Halo 4. It's already live on the Xbox. I am on Xbox. So, um, I figured, why don't we take a look at the customization? Uh, so I already went ahead and changed my Spartans colors, the usual white, and I went with the forest green. Um, I kind of like the darker green, so if you guys already kind of know from Halo 5 and I guess not really any other games, you don't really see my Spartan, but, uh, in Halo 5, I used them in a couple thumbnails. Usually, I go with the with the white and the green. Uh, those are my two favorite colors. Fun fact: the I didn't realize I didn't put this together until way later. But those are the colors of Tommy Oliver from Power Rangers, white and green. And it makes so much sense why these are my favorite colors. Tommy was my favorite Ranger back in the day. But uh, anyways, enough about that. Let's go ahead and look at these helmets there's nothing new here at least not to my knowledge um, I wasn't big on Halo 4 I was in college when this game came out um, so I didn't really I played it hardcore but I didn't really pay attention to many things if that makes sense so we got recruit recruit prime warrior warrior matrix air assault um, it's kind of weird how they group these. Some of these they group together, some of these they don't. I guess if there's two variants they didn't group them together. Um, maybe they, I feel like they should just, if it has more than one variant just group it. Like there's, you know, you're just making the super long list. Um, and I kind of wish they also previewed like, uh, so this is the recruit, but then it switches back to recruit when you hover over air assault. Um, so I wish they kind of just previewed the base helmet, you know, they don't have to do much. Uh, again, I don't know what the back end looks like for this. Uh, but yeah, these are the helmets. Defender va variant, so you got Defender Control. Oh! Defender helmet customized with control coding. Hint, hint. So, is this confirmation that coding is just a skin? That is interesting right there um so recon search coding yeah so all of these say coding for the for the skins wow okay well, look at here breaking news you know your boy has all the latest scoops even though he finds the scoops live but uh let's not let's not talk about that so you got scout toxic toxic coding coding orbital so I ran through these already um, once before just to you know quickly check it out but uh yeah there's no ODST helmets there's no like I said I don't remember much about Halo 4 EOD stormtrooper looking looking helmet this one's pretty cool I somewhat like this one um, I was watching an old video, Halo 5 video, where I go through the, what was the pack called? I forget what the pack was called, but I also said it was Stormtrooper-like back then. Um, I even said I used it in Halo 3 for a bit, and that's, you know, true. I did use it in Halo 3 for a bit. I uh, don't think I'll be using it in this one. This one, <laughs> I just noticed these, uh... These like green things there where the holes are, they look like eyeballs. Those kind of threw me off right there. Uh, Pathfinder, Pathfinder, Engineer, Stalker, Stalker, Crush, Rogue, Rogue. Uh, I'm trying to think. I think the Halo 3 helmet that I use is also co called Rogue. Um, I'm trying to remember. I'm pretty sure it is called Rogue. Disappointing. If it is, it's disappointing that it's not the same helmet. Um, 
I'll throw it up on screen right now. Um, I should probably look it up, look up what it what it's called. But uh, yeah. So we got the CIO, three little dots here. Venator, uh, Venator Raptor, Bayonet, and Refractive. Gangnir. I used this one for a bit. I like this one until I was like, man, I want to see a visor color. And then I switched it to a to something else. I think uh, we'll, we'll probably be choosing the recon for this for this flight. I think I have the recon on the MCC, but Locus is also a super dope helmet. Uh, I just I really like that like X um, across the the head. I kind of if I can make a change to this. I would make that X into like a, the the visor, so you can mess with the visor color. Um, if that was the case, if that X was the visor, this would definitely be the go-to helmet for me. So we got Scanner, Strider, Photus, the Unicorn. I think this one was like a pre-order back in Halo 4, or might have been for Halo 5. I don't remember. Um, but yeah, those are the helmets. Let's check it out. I think I'm just gonna go with Recon. Um, can't beat the classic. So let's go with Recon Surge. I like this that one a little bit more. The three stripes. So for shoulders, we got so this is left shoulder recruit, recruit prime warrior, warrior, warrior matrix, the air assault variants, um, the verge and vision, soldier, soldier, soldier zenith. I'm having like trouble speaking. Uh, aviator, av aviator bond. I'll just stop naming them. I'm stuttering over my words. Control column, recon, surge, EVA, EVA, breach. I almost said birch. War master, uh, war master primal. I know I said I was not gonna name the names, but here I, I'm going. <laughs> Apex and toxic. Uh, the Shoulder pads, the, I'm not a huge fan of uh, the armor in Halo 4. Um, I was just noticing it's already like, it just reminds me so much of Halo Halo 5 and, whoops, I accidentally chose has up. But uh, even though, I mean, it's such a sticky topic. Um, there's a lot of, I see a lot more hate than uh than praise for the Halo 4 and Halo 5 armors. Um, it's just, you know, it's a bummer for 343. They, you know, poured their time, their effort, heart and souls into this just to get crapped on. But, I mean, what can you do? Uh, it's not that, it's not that great. Um, I'll just leave it at that. Uh, Stalker Crush, Rogue. This one's actually pretty cool. Might go with this one actually. Um, I was thinking about just sticking with the what's it called? Uh, the recruit. What the hell is it? It's the shoulder piece? Um, oh, let's check these out. Web. Re oh, I vaguely remember there being a uh, like a pre-order for like a spider type of skin or I guess coating now it's called this one's actually not that bad I kind of like the black with the the black with the white and then there's like the green underneath might be choosing CIO rush I don't know which one did I say earlier rogue rogue I think I'm gonna go with CIO that one looks way better uh, than the venator Ooh, actually this one looks like my Halo 5 one. I, Venator might be the Halo 5 armor I run. Uh, Gungnir, Gungnir Pulse, Commando. Uh, not, yeah, not too much to say about these things. Photos, I, so, alright. I think I'm gonna go with CIO. That one really just stuck out to me. This one is cool. Um, you know what? We can do both. Why not? So we got the right side. Uh, nothing special. You don't get like an exclusive one. So we'll do... Mm, 
do I like how that looks? Mm, maybe, okay, so we'll do it like this. We'll do rush on this side. And then we'll do... Where's rogue, 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 rogue. Rogue. I'll do this one. This one on this side. All right, there we go. That's how we're gonna do it. So for the chest, again, nothing new. Oh, we've seen all these names for the other ones, and also it doesn't. I guess it doesn't help that the white kind of makes it look plasticky, styrofoamy. Uh, we could also look at the back here. The jetpacks also change for these guys. Uh, what did the recon one look like? So also, as, as I'm going through these, I'm going to be mentally deciding which one I want to run in multiplayer. As it is right now on the MCC Halo 4. You know, you just pick one thing and that's it. That's like, for example, uh, if I chose Recon, I'd get the whole Recon set for the Spartan. So this piece by piece customization is new for the Halo 4 flight. It was pretty damn cool. This design looks not, doesn't look too bad. Kind of reminds me a mix of like the Punisher with, uh, uh, what's Boba Fett? Hazop, Hazop, uh, Forest, EOD. EOD doesn't look too bad either. I kind of like the blocky look. Uh, EOD, EOD Shadow. I think I, Shadow, this would also be a contender for me. Um, it's Oceanic. Here we go. Oceanic, the, the big daddy armor. Uh, got a, did Bioshock come around, come out around the Halo 4 time? I don't know. Um, it's very interesting that they decided to do a Scuba Steve looking suit armor, set of armor. Pathfinder, Pathfinder Core, Engineer, so maybe the CIO has the um, oh this Rogue one also looks pretty cool. Uh, maybe the CIO has the spider. I do very clearly remember. There you go. Boom. I might have to do this. I think I had this armor back in Halo 4. So I might just choose this for the cool Spider-Man look. Uh, yeah. yeah. I think it... Oh. Ooh, this one, ooh, I kind of like this one too, but for now we'll just run the, the Spider-Man look. And I'm almost like 90% positive the Venator armor is the one I use in Halo 5. I will also have to double check that one. So we go Protector, Protector Drift, Mark 6, almost at Mark 5, Raider. Raider Distort Photos. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with this spider for now. Just to shout out to Spider Man, my man's my favorite superhero. And we get some forearm customization, which uh, is a surprise to me. I wasn't expecting it, even though it is in reach. Um, I don't even remember them mentioning there was gonna be piece by piece customization I could be wrong uh, but I don't it's not clearly coming back to me uh, those weekly updates they talk about what to expect in the flight um so here we have the X V what's that 1527 shifting slide uh, this one's pretty cool might go with this one um, I'll, I'll just select it for now Mark Mark Six looks good. I'm a little bit more. I like that uh, there's more green showing on this one, whereas the Mark Six doesn't have as much green showing. And then Photos, there you go. Yeah, cause I guess I'll just stick with that one. Legs, we got Recruit Tiger RG63. These. Uh, 
these leg pieces make the Spartans look super robotic. Um, instead of, you know, looking like armor. Uh, I don't know what it is. I, maybe it's because they're showing too much undersuit for me. Um, past Halos, I think, like, the shin part and the leg part look, at least, even if they weren't connected, it looked like it gave the illusion that it was connected. So, uh, and also, I think the old Halos had, like, the whole lower leg covered. Um, I want to say, like, the whole leg was covered, really, except for, like, the inner thighs were really the only things exposed down in the legs. Um, so here we got the contoured. Ooh, this is contoured greaves based on Sangeli technology. That's, yeah. You know, that's cool. Didn't even know that. Uh, overlocking. Uh, overlocking web. So this would be the piece to finish off that uh, armor piece we chose. Marks it. So here is a somewhat of an example of what I was talking about. How like the whole uh, lower leg was covered and then like the inner thighs were ex are exposed. Um, that's really the only part that's uh exposed in the old in the old classic style um i don't even no i should really take a look uh at a picture before i you know talk out of my ass but i'm fairly certain that's that's how it is um you know it's a first person shooter so and things move so quickly i don't spend a lot of time uh, looking at legs or looking at armor really so please forgive me uh, I'm not exactly sure which one I want to go with um, I might just go with this one the overlocking uh, overlocking web um, yeah I think that might be the one that's the this one's pretty cool this uh lg 50 i'm guessing that stands for large um but i think i will just go with this one this one's also pretty cool and it completes the upper part of the spartan and then finally we have the visor color and um can't select anything of course this is the flight things like these are to be expected um these glitches I can't even choose anything oh there we go can I choose visor color there we go so we got solar frost midnight cyan blindside sunspot verdant legendary wet work operator pioneer pathfinder engineer stalker uh, rogue tracker and that's it um I don't know <laughs> nothing really n none of these are really all that appealing to me I think I'll just go with midnight and go with that black on black on white on green head and that seems to be it I guess one more thing I can show you guys is I was uh, playing around with these and they have a couple weapon skins um, so I guess this is customized with a teeth skin turbine skin and trauma skin so these aren't in the flight themselves but I'm again I don't remember if these were originally in Halo 4 but these are some things some season 4 rewards I'm guessing is what it's gonna be so this one we have a preview of the blast uh, battle rifle skin um yeah like I said don't remember if it was in the original Halo 4 uh, I should know so this one still has like that the coating uh, the word I'm looking for like the coating syntax um, you got uh, dollar sign DMR BLD description um, BLD I don't know the only word that's coming to me is bald so there you go storm rifle compression uh, Covenants so you got the Covenant rain skin and then you get the Covenant locomotive skin suppressor a Covenant uh, carbine I should say Covenant carbine 
suppressor shatter skin and then the mechanical skin and then finally on the light rifle you get the imprint imprint skin and the industrial skin so yeah that's maybe a preview of, of season four like I said two or three times already um, nothing or uh, I don't remember if those were originally in Halo 4 but there you have it guys that's gonna be it for this video just wanted to do a quick uh, update that we are live with uh, the Halo 4 flight Halo 4 flight um, again in the last video I said everyone that signs up would make it in but then the day after a couple hours after I uploaded my video last Friday sketch went onto the waypoint forums and said there was actually a cutoff time of Thursday at like 3 o'clock 3 p.m. P, uh, Pacific Standard Time so that was like almost a whole 24 hours before I uploaded my video again wanna apologize for that misinformation uh, that wasn't known to me at the time so you know I try to bring you guys the latest news and information that is available that is public knowledge I don't have uh, I joke around that I have the inside scoop but you know I'm just gathering this information from Twitter from official posts official halo posts official 343 posts forum posts reddit posts you know I, I don't have an inside man if that wasn't already clear uh, I'm a small channel <laughs> don't don't have the hookups but yeah that's gonna be it if you guys enjoyed the video remember to give the video a thumbs up actually before this reminds me looking at my uh, what's it called nameplate so we have these nameplates here so I believe this is the last one you get from season 3 and then you have anniversary uh, Movember veteran National Native American Heritage Month and Infinite so I'm fairly sure those are new but if they're not um, you guys can just call me a doodoo -doo head idiot down in the comments below but I'm like oh here we actually go I actually didn't even scroll down here so it looks like more season 4 preview uh, it looks like a knight this one's actually pretty cool the, the didact skull uh, Halo 4 Cortana this is I'm guessing a crawler uh, an elite <laughs> I don't know why I paused there no idea what this is looks like it could be maybe like one of those forerunner platforms I don't know uh, no idea what this is either master chief um, looks like it's maybe the didax armor uh, infinity I'm guessing infinity again and then like the giant Requi requiem didax ball and then finally the didact in his helmet uh, not finally again the didact uh the librarian dr halsey all right now it's finally finally dr halsey so there you go um i guess i'm probably gonna call this season four preview uh let's maybe there's some more avatars in here we can we can scope out uh I, I would have no idea if any of these would be brand new or not um yeah so like so again I was talking about earlier you select the one piece of armor and it gives you the whole suit so this is what it originally would be like so if you want to choose photos boom you select photos and you get the whole thing uh, I think that's it though yeah we got some some exclusive breaking news once again these nameplates down here um, probably have to unlock them with the season points yeah you do actually it says in the description duh alright well <laughs> again that's gonna be it for me guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're not already subscribed and uh, leave a comment letting me know what you're excited for in season 4 
and I will talk to you in the next one.